Vlog. Welcome to Ruth and Black. For today's video, ay tatalakayin natin ang mga step and requirements this 2022 for Teacher 1 applicant. And also, I will share to you on how to make your own pertinent papers cover, the table of contents, and the color shims of your folder that you will be used. Pero bago ang lahat, ay nais ko lamang po maglambing sa inyo na pa-subscribe naman po na YouTube channel na ito. Salamat po! What are you waiting for? Just keep on watching! Our video entitled Pertinent Papers for Teacher 1 Applicant as of 2022 is made to inform and help you through your application as Teacher 1 Applicant in any areas of learning. For more accurate information if there are changes, ask the school principal or the school head to avoid hassle or misconceptions. The following are the needed documentary requirements as part of the ranking process. The written application indicating the unique application number, CSC Form 212 Personal Data Sheet Revised 2017 in two copies with the latest passport size ID picture, certified photocopy of PRC, certificate of registration or license that is not expired, and the certified photocopy of rating obtained in the licensure examination, Certified copies of DOR including Certification of General Weighted Average issued by the School or School Selection Committee, copies of Service Record, Performance Rating, and School Clearance for those with teaching experience. Certificate of Specialized Training, if any, Certified copy of the Voter's ID or Barangay Clearance, NBI Clearance, and of course, the Omnibus Certification of Authenticity and veracity of all documents submitted, signed by the applicant and duly notarized. And now, let us know the color schemes of the pertinent papers for Teacher 1 applicant. On the left side, we have the position or grade level and the right side, the color of folder. For kindergarten, green plastic folder. For elementary, white folder. Please read the following for the color schemes of the pertinent papers for Teacher applicant in junior high school. Remember that the color coding depends on their major or areas of specialization. Next, let us know how to make a pertinent papers cover. The font size of your pertinent papers folder is long. Just write the pertinent documents for teacher 1 or pertinent papers for teacher 1 in the center. Then write your name in printed letters over the level of your specialization. And don't forget to write your contact details which is your cell phone number and Gmail account below. And last, let us know how to make your table content of your pertinent papers. In the table of content, I use numbers and letters to indicate the sequence of the documents. For elementary level, don't forget to use tabbing to organize it and for the information to be easier to find or handle. And here is an example of number tabbings and the letter tabbings. At kung sa tingin mo ay nakatulong sa inyo ang video na ito, pa-like naman po at don't forget to click the notification bell below to be updated on my incoming videos. Salamat po!